Do you want to be able to fix your Duolingo app icon? Well, then this video is going to be perfect for you. Because as you can see, nowadays, for some reason, Duolingo app does look kind of weird, as you can see. So if you want to be able to fix it, well, then you are in the right place. So what you're going to do firstly is to either go into the App Store if you have an iPhone or Google Play Store if you have an Android. And it's just going to load here for me. And in here, we're just going to search for Duolingo. So search for Duolingo on your App Store or Google Play Store, scroll down in here, and then what you're going to do, you're going to find if it says update in here. It should be like a blue button that says update. And if it is, just click on it and wait for the Duolingo app to automatically update to the latest version. And when it does, then sometimes your icon can actually automatically switch to the default icon instead that was before. But it doesn't uh, like always work unfortunately. And one of the reasons why Duolingo seems to actually change their icon as of right now to this kind of weird, you, as you can see there's like a weird icon right now. And one of the reasons seems to be that if you for example skip the lesson one or two times, then it might actually change it to this like weird icon so that you can you can actually click on it and then get back into your lesson so as you can see this update didn't fix my problem and the reason for that is that i haven't really used duolingo for quite a while to be honest so if that is the same thing with you that you haven't used duolingo for a while well then try to do some lessons like just go into there and then just spend a couple of minutes and then wait until tomorrow and see if that has now changed for you because that can also fix this problem and if you have done lessons and you still have this like weird icon right here as you can see it's like it's not updating for you well, it might be that uh, that probably it is like that for you, unfortunately, that you will just have to wait for their newest update. They will hopefully change it for you as well in the coming future. But that is basically exactly how to fix this.